Hi there YouTube, quick video on the Sacro Vault. Um, doing it in sections because getting one section done at a time like this one seems to work better. And with this not attached, I can get to a lot of detail that you wouldn't be able to get to otherwise. Like the vines that are right here and that sort of stuff. Um, it's also a lot easier to work with just one section, whereas if you're trying to pick up the whole thing, it's it, this model has a lot of heft to it, it's, it's all resin, so that makes it a little bit heavier. Um, this is my first try with candles and this vine work. Let me know what y'all think. I did some, some coloring on the soles here. I, I'm calling these soles that, that the skulls are representing. And I will get it on its base after the other two sections are completed. Um, but like I said, the, uh, the vines, I, I used a, a green wash over more of a brownish green to get this color vine. I like how it turned out because I tried it with a brighter green or a darker green at first, like what's on the snake head. And they did stand out, but it just didn't look right to me. Because if you're going to be a vine in the woods, you're going to have a lot more dirt and that sort. Of, you're not going to be a clean green color, you know, unless you're grass or something. But vines generally don't have that in the jungles or the swamps. Um, so this is the section I've gotten completed. And the next section that I'll probably be working on is this one. Loads of detail in this model loads of detail. I easily spent four or five hours uh, all told just getting this done. At any rate, hope y'all are enjoying the videos. I'll try to keep putting them out. Let me know if you have any suggestions and keep on wargaming.